if you'd like to support the channel, or if you just enjoy helping me save up for another failed marriage, consider picking up a copy of my book, Discarded Horse Feathers, available at all major online retailers. I mean, when you think about it, the domestic cat sits at the top of the animal kingdom. Uh, I'm gonna go powder my nose. <laughs> either the cat or like the lion. Help! 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 Well, what's the problem? This toilet, it's not fancy enough. The back, it's white. Oh, that is bad. <laughs> Dude, I don't know where she's been. I answered her distress call by cleaning the lid with soap and hot water. <laughs> Freaking hot. Next, the shiny outer layer needs to be stripped so that a chemical and mechanical bond can be formed. We'll let that set for about an hour before washing off. Still got some gloss there, so I do want to do one more coat. Important to get these edges, too. The epoxy will have a tendency to run off. Anyways, we want it as absolutely groovy as possible. I've found the best results with a repeat treatment. Completely matte, like a marshmallow. Lightly sand with 120 grit before applying a strong primer. Once dry, I prefer to tape the edges, which will prevent excessive roll-off. And try to keep these on the thing, because oh, they yeah. do kind of leak a little bit. Why don't you do like red and black? Red, black. You're colorblind, right? Yeah. I shouldn't use colors. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was inconsiderate. Oh my gosh. Why do you have something out for my people? I know, right? Mm. Okay, this is the biggest. That's probably all you need. Oh, oh it's jumping out. <laughs> <laughs> Half the cup or something. In a worm. You need that big metal shovel. <laughs> <laughs> what is that thingy? What do a you call it? Trough? Like oh, a, yeah. <laughs> what is it a one eighth inch trough? Ah. Okay, it looks like a big hole. <laughs> Can I just do a little bit in it? Yeah, yeah, of course. Okay. It's your toilet. It looked bigger than I thought it. Crisscrossing it. Okay. Kind yeah. of like a Christmas bars, like Christmas bars that you make. How sometimes they drizzle like the juice or whatever. <laughs> Let's apply a little bit of that shimmering yellow gold, which will match the bathroom and my shorts. That looks kind of classy. Yay. Hmm. Cool. Yay. Okay. We gotta do some exotics though. Yeah. That's where the money's at. Yeah. <laughs> a couple quick torch passes will liberate any bubbles and encourage top flow. Now let's prepare the exotic okay. pour. Whatever you imagine. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know. That looks like you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, where would you do it? Do, you do we got it? them all in? I didn't do the iridescent. Oh, let's dump the rest of the iridescent in there. Do it wherever. All of it? I didn't know if I loved it though. Oh, take it out then. Uh oh. Oh no, it, now it's pink. <laughs> <laughs> How the heck did it get pink? I'm really nervous it's going to be pink now. But you're just <laughs> fucked everything up last time. <laughs> made it purple. <laughs> so I think we're just gonna go just like that.
Nice, that looks good. We're going heavy right here. Okay. Where's the pink? I see it. It's you do it. not. I do. It's a little bit. I do see a little. <laughs> I promise. You know, it was just like drip, 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 drip. It just has like this cool effect. I mean, maybe, I can't do it. Do like one drip in between those yellow drips. Okay, that's good. Oh, dude, that that looks sick, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> And this reminds me too much of cheese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like it. Do you I just, like that cheese part? I think it's fine, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Maybe a little of the iridescent. Yes! It's okay. She's learning. Uh. <laughs> Actually, that's really cool. Yay! That looks like cheesecake. <laughs> Can't see what I'm doing when I'm over it. Oh yeah. <laughs> I really like it. And what if we just like chop it up? Okay. <laughs> Thanks for doing the hard part, the acid and the teeping. <laughs> <laughs> I should buy Mike Reif your book for... Does he know I wrote it? Uh, we didn't talk about it this last time. My dad told me there was some book that was really... Oh my gosh! What? This thing's melting. Oh my gosh. It's melting. <gasps> oh, you oh. just dropped some! Yeah! <laughs> And so just like encourage it down like that. This is looking really neat. Wow. What's it doing? Looking more like a tiger. Yeah. Great. Because you don't want that empty space. Hell no. Is this better than your first one you did? Hell yeah. Nice. That cheese area? Got demolished, and now I love it. Yeah. <laughs> so you, I should never question your intuition <laughs> ever again. <laughs> you are so funny. Here's the iridescent. Okay, now what? 24 hours later, we'll tape the edges in preparation for our flood coat. This layer contains no color or pigments. After about 30 minutes, we'll peel that tape and coat the edges. Wow, absolutely stunning. While curing, keep it protected from dust. And I also like to clean up drips using a silicone spatula. Unfortunately, some still formed, which warrants a gentle sanding. As a finishing touch, I added our Vestigial Voice logo plate. Gee, she's been in there a long time. You all right in there? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> what the heck is going on? Can I come in? Sure, yeah, come on in. Oh, 
You've changed. Well, so have you. <laughs> we are Vestigial Voice. Please like and subscribe as you feel is appropriate. And we hope you visit us again.